Nissan and um, I've hired a car and as you all know I love a Nissan Q and here we are they've given me a Nissan Q so I'm off to Tatsumi PA which is if, you, if you're into Japanese car scene you'll recognize the car park it's the one where they're parked and you've got the skyscrapers in the background so I'm off there hopefully with it being the final round of D1 GP and yeah D1 GP this weekend um, there might be some cool cars there, we might get to see some street cars and yeah, I'm really looking forward to it and so we're going to go over the Rainbow Bridge into Tatsumi and just have a look around and see what we can find so yeah, this IQ <laughs> to Sumi PA and um, to say it um, wasn't a stressful journey <laughs> would be the um, Maria. Can you turn the screen away from me? Panda, it's blinding me in the eye. Oh wasn't. please, it's blinding you. That's so Why rubbish. are you being Why didn't you record that? Continue straight. Can you release the cords? Yeah. 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 The, the issue is with Google Maps is that it can't quite understand levels so it was sending us on the bottom level where this this parking lot is actually on the top on the highway anyway backwards and forwards been over the rainbow bridge three times now um but we're here um, and the view is pretty incredible it's so good GTR in the wild. Now these are pretty rare in the UK and just to see one parked up in a parking lot is pretty cool. It's got all the right things on. It's got um, Ray's T37. Uh, it's even got a roll cage on it which is pretty cool. But just to see just to see one on the street is one of the reasons why I want to come to that and just see stuff like this out and about. It's, it's all pretty cool, and so you've got stuff like this, and then you've got this McLaren P1 that you're about to pull off. So another rare car that you don't often see in the UK is this what I think is a C35 Laurel. Definitely a Laurel, I'm sure you'll tell me if I'm wrong anyway. Um, just cool, finished on SSR wheels. Oh, I just really like seeing this sort of thing just out and about. And then with, the, with that backdrop as well, perfect. And then you got this AMG C63 rolling around as well. One thing I have noticed is that all of the cool um, European imports, like your Ferraris, your Porsches, the yeah, AMGs, they've got them left hand drive, which seems really weird when you can get them as a right hand drive option. But I don't, I don't know why they do that. There's, I thought there would be some cars, but we've had like a Ferrari F40, Evos, McLaren. Oh, blown away. So and good. An amazing view. Yeah, look at that. What more do you want in a night? Food, maybe. <laughs>
places to be right now in a like in a traffic a cram in a car park. We've got an old Ferrari here. I don't know my Ferrari. But then we got a Lamborghini, Corvette C5. We've got a couple of Lexus RSFs, we've got S14s, we've got Chasers. I knew it was going to be like. In 300 meters, turn right. I knew it was going to be like full of wild cars, like not what we're used to in the UK, but man, that's it. And then you're coming home, look at the view as we're coming down here. Like, I like the view of Birmingham as you come over the M6. <laughs> this is something else. A little bit different. Yeah. 